today, me and my cameraman Desmond, we'd headed out into the fields of Paris. Everything is frozen. Everything frozen solid. Icicles coming from everything. Power lines falling down. Everything. And we were right smack dab in the middle of it. Well, we we caught up. We were near the Hevron Den, and I've been tracking this Hevrons, these Hevrons for weeks now at a time. And I finally caught up with them. So check this out. All right, here we are. We are in. We're on the Paris streets. We are trying to locate the Hevron feeding uh, fields. Um, we went out. I've been tracking this clan for about two weeks. Oh shit! Anyway, he kind of scared me there. He, he stepped on the gas. But um, right now, I'll let you take a look here. It's quite dim and dreary outside. Probably looks brighter on the camera, actually. Um, we're on the road with Desmond. Now, Desmond, what do you think? Do you think we're going to spot the Hevrons today? 50 50 chance. They're, see, the, the thing about the Hevrons is they're very hard to get out of the house. They're, they're very rare to see them out in, in the wild because they mostly stay in the den. They're very seclusive. They creatures. Play the video games. They play the video games all the all day. It's very, very difficult to see them out in the wild. So that's what we're trying to accomplish today. Is we're trying to see if we can see some out in the wild. Um, they are mostly those hevrons? are those hevrons. No, those aren't the hevrons. Those aren't oh, the they're hevrons. reindeer. They're the reindeer. But I mean, we've we've been looking for the hevrons, and now I think since it's so cold, there's icicles on everything. I think since it's so cold, we may actually get a chance to see them today because, well, the hevrons. The only time they 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 leave from the den, the only time they leave from the den is when it gets cold, so that they can forage. But um, we're gonna see if we can see some today. I'm not sure, but we are going to try. So uh, stay tuned. As we made our way to the Hevron Den and onto the Hevron feeding fields, and we walked past all the destruction, I couldn't help but just kind of doubt myself that we wouldn't see the Hevrons. I was really hoping that we would. I was hoping that maybe there was just a slight chance that they would come out to forage for their food, like I've read in so many books. Hopefully, just hopefully we would find what we were looking for at the feeding field. We're right here in the Paris football fields and we're looking to see if we can find a clan of Hevrons today. Now, I've been chasing one for about two or three weeks, but I haven't got them to leave the den yet. But I think since these power outages have occurred, they are going to leave the den. So uh, maybe we can get a close-up of them if we just scout around a little bit. Um, everything is falling, everything's frozen as you can see here. Everything, everything is frozen. And I think the Hevrons See, the Hevrons like this frozen because most of the time they spend the time in in their den. And they, but now that the power outage has, has occurred, they are not able to do anything, so they have to get out and forage. And we, I think that we are going to, fi we, we're finally going to get to see a clan. I think that we're finally going to get to see a clan of them. I think, I'm not sure, but uh, the den's right over here. Uh, so we're just going to wait it out here, maybe take a stroll and see what we see. So this is Hunter Swift with the Hevron Hunter. Stay tuned. As we strolled across the feeding fields, I looked over and I finally found what I was looking for. The clan of Hevrons that so long eluded me. Finally, I was like, yes, I finally have found them. I was so excited because no one has got them. Can you zoom in? Can we get a better look? Can you zoom in on the Hevron clan? The 
see we've been following this clan for a few weeks now. And they just vacated from the den over there to come out in the winter months to forage in the frozen. leave the young ones behind. See, because they, they need to teach the young ones to fend for themselves. As you can see, they're trying to leave the young ones. I don't know, I don't know what they're doing. I think, sending out a Hevron call. As you can see, oh, there they go. They're trying to get ice for the daiquiris. Shriek. <laughs> he let out the Hevron streak. My god, I don't think we've ever got I don't think we've ever got this clan on film. This is, see they left see how they leave the small one behind. Do you see? Now the reason the reason they do this the reason they do this is because the young Hevron, if they're not taught at a young age what to do, as you can see she's trying to catch up now. If they don't leave them alone at a young age, they will never learn for themselves. Okay, I think they've spotted us. Danger, danger, danger. You know, we try to watch every little step that we took. You can't be too careful around the Hevrons. Well, that was one of the closest encounters I've ever been in with any Hevron clan at ever. We finally caught up to him. I was so excited. My heart was pounding out of my chest. I was sweating bullets. I didn't know what to do. I was like, we need to keep downwind a little. And maybe they won't smell us. But they, 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 they never caught on, they didn't know we were there. It was great, we got some great footage. And this, will, this is definitely one of my most dangerous adventures. See, we've got this path here. This path goes from the street all the way here. Then it goes to this entrance to this building. Which goes absolutely nowhere. I believe it's magic. I'm going to try to go in the entrance now. Go. Goodbye. Well, by God, I think he's done it. So what's on the other side? You don't want to know. Alright. This is Hunter Swint and Desmond Barnes today on the Hevron Hunters. Now, Hevron hunting is a very serious It's game. a very serious game. Very, 